Welcome to the Science Kid. I'm your host, Quinn Friedman, and today we are going to learn about eclipses. Now, what are eclipses? Eclipses are when an object in space covers another object in space. There are two main types of eclipses that can be seen from Earth. The first type of eclipses are solar eclipses. This eclipse occurs when the moon covers the sun, which causes us not to see most or any of the sun. The last solar eclipse to hit Earth from when this was filming was actually August 21st, 2017. This eclipse caused certain parts of the Earth to go dark. Wait. There are three types of solar eclipses, depending on where you're experiencing the eclipse. The first part is an umbra eclipse. This occurs when the moon completely blocks the sun, causing total darkness. Ah, Not again! The next part is an ant-umbra eclipse. This occurs when the moon is blocking most of the sun. However, a little tiny outline of the sun is still visible. Lastly, the final part is a penumbra eclipse. This occurs when the moon is blocking part of the sun, causing there to still be part of the sun visible. Another thing about solar eclipses is you must wear protective eyewear or you might go blind. The second type of eclipses are lunar eclipses. This occurs when the Earth blocks the sun from the moon. Lunar. Solar. Lunar. Solar. Lunar. Solar. <laughs> there are also three types of lunar eclipses. The first is a penumbral lunar eclipse, where the sun is only shining on part of the moon. The next part is a partial lunar eclipse, where the sun is shining on less than half of the moon. The last part is a total lunar eclipse, where the Earth is completely covering the sun from shining the moon. This can cause the moon to look red or orange. And I've also learned that lunar and solar eclipses can cause yourself to turn into your baby sister. I hope you enjoy lunar and solar eclipses. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Sun can always be fun.